Hey guys, MP Carlson here. Time for another vlog, and we're going back to my face again. Uh, the reason I took down the last video that had my face in was because, um, for those of you who don't know, I have uh, social anxiety. I'm not joking, I, I really do have it. Um, and it was just, you know, self-confidence issues. I, I just didn't want <laughs> uh, my face out there. But, you know, I've, I've more or less gotten comfortable with that now, so, you know, I'm comfortable being on camera now. It's fine. Um, I don't care who's watching this. I don't care if it's anyone that I know in real life is watching this. I don't care if people in my family are watching this. I don't know why they would, because I don't think this would interest them in any way. But anyway, um, I decided to make a video about something that's been on my mind, and uh, some of your minds as well, recently. And that's that um, since the end of last year, I've been uploading a lot less small YTPs. I'm still creating the big YTPs, of course, um, and compared to last year, I'm picking up the pace on those. <laughs> um, the reason there was a significant lack last year is because as soon as Five Nights at Foster's finished in April, I just like went straight in and I've been working on Mash Bandicoot ever since then, and that's taken a really long time. <laughs> I mean, it, it shouldn't have really taken as long as it did. It was, it was a lot, a lot of it was because, um, stuff going on in my, in my life and, uh, I basically just didn't get round to properly editing it for a long time. It took a, a big break when I shouldn't have done. But yeah, this year I'd probably get a lot more big YTPs, you know, like the ones that are around 12 minutes or over 12 minutes in terms of, um, in terms of length. But, um, in terms of smaller YTPs, I just haven't really had the time for them ever since I set my mind to working on other types of videos. And I know so far there's only been music, as well as those weird one-offs like, um, Bulls, Seagulls, and I'm Gonna Pee. <laughs> but I, I've been planning a lot of other stuff, stuff that I won't reveal just yet. But, like I've said before, um, this isn't just a YTP channel. I, I don't want to limit my channel to just YTPs. I want to feel free to make what I want without worrying that you guys won't approve of it. <laughs> I'm still making YTPs, of course. Why would I ever stop? And, uh, you know, I'm putting the same level of imagination and creativity into every other video that I make. It's, uh, you know, I'm still the same person. It's not like I have a, a team who, like, each person does a certain type of video. It's all done by me. It's all done with the same mind, the same style. And, um... You know, I'd rather put more effort into the larger YTPs than make some mediocre YTP every week or so. Um, some of you may disagree with that, and some of you may think that the the smaller, the shorter YTPs are actually better. But um, I do prefer the big ones. I can I can be a lot more creative with them. I can add a lot more variety into them, and just you know generally add a lot more into them. <laughs> My voice went weird then when I said more, 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 more. I had a lot more into them. And, um, yeah, a few of you don't like this, and you'd prefer to kind of just have both and not have the stuff in between, and not have the one-offs. Just have, like, the big YTPs, and then in the, in the meantime between them, have smaller YTPs and nothing else. But I'm not going to do that. Because, uh, you know, while I... I do care what you guys think, and I do cater some of my videos somewhat to what you guys want. Um... Okay, well, that was kind of annoying. My, uh, camera just ran out of memory while I was talking. Something always goes wrong whenever I try to do this. Also, do you like my little setup I did? I got, like, the camera properly facing me, and, uh, I got these things. General Certificate of Education. So that you know that I am uh, somewhat educated. <laughs> and I got this thing that says, sell this bagel. It's an inside joke, don't worry about it. Anyway, um, let's get back to what I was saying, which I cannot remember. Yeah, I don't like the idea of not being allowed to upload what I want. And uh, you may not like all of it. I don't expect you to like all of it. But, uh, you know, please don't try to stop me. Because, <laughs> um... Not only do other people enjoy them, but I enjoy them. 
And also, just because a video isn't labelled as YouTube poop in the title, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's not going to appeal to a regular YouTube poop watcher. There will be things in my other videos that are distinctly NP Carlson, even if they're not distinctly YouTube poop. And even then, they still might have YouTube poop elements in them. Probably not very many. You know, I may even put some in this video. But yeah, every video of mine is done with the same mind and with the same style. Well, apart from music, I suppose. Because, um, you know, that's not edited in the same way that an animation or a vlog is. But even then, you know, I'm still putting the same level of creative effort as I would in any other video. However, that's not to say that there will never be small YTPs ever again. There will still be collab entries now and then. In fact, I'm just about to finish one. I'm hopefully going to get it done by the end of today. It's for um, Jimmy Davis's YouTube Pooper Collab, and I literally just watched a video he just made. I've, I've, re I've really nearly finished my entry, and I've worked really hard on it. I think it's pretty good. And also, he's going to um, do an entry for my collab, which is pretty cool. So just, you know, back and forth, swap over. But yeah, I get, I get motivated to do collab entries, but I'm not really often motivated to make other YTPs unless ideas just come out of nowhere from watching a certain source. But that doesn't, that doesn't happen that often. It's usually when I think, okay, I want to use this source, and then I watch it, and then I get ideas, I try them out, I form more ideas, and that's when I make the bigger, more creative YTPs. Whereas the smaller YTPs, I'm not very motivated. Like, if it was something like... Something like Trapdoor or something. Yeah, I could probably think of some ideas, but I wouldn't be very motivated to just make a... Like a, a minute and a half YTP of Trapdoor. I mean, I might do that, but... I, I, I do prefer doing the larger ones. Um, also, um, I hope you realise that I, I know that a lot of you know this. You know, um, a lot of you, I've said this many times before and a lot of you understand it. A lot of you appreciate that and I appreciate that you appreciate that. <laughs> but, you know, this is just for clarification and just for the people who don't quite understand my thought processes or processes, however you like to say it. But, um, yeah, the reason I'm addressing it is because a lot of you just kind of expect white TPs, like, all the time, and anything else is just kind of written off as useless and terrible and not really given a chance, and you're just like, what are you doing, NP Carlson? Hurry up and make a white TP. I'm almost always making a white TP. They take a freaking long time, especially the way I do them. I don't know if um, I do them a different... I probably do them a different way to other people, and maybe that makes it so they take longer, I don't know. Probably the the stupid video editors I've got. But I, I, do, I do the best I can with them. And But, you know, that's, that's one of the reasons I need to do other types of videos, because I will get demotivated, and um, it will lose its enjoyability, and I never want that to happen. You know, granted, um, YTPs are one of the most enjoyable things to do with my time, and I'm so glad that I found them. Um, I can't do them for every single second of every single day. <laughs> you know, I, I will get demotivated, it will lose its enjoyability, and I really don't want that to happen. I don't want this to be ruined for me, or for you, I just, you know... You know, taking a break for even just a day to work on something else is the best way to keep my spirits up and my enjoyment up for what I work so hard on and love doing. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. I, just, I know you, a lot of you have heard all this before, I just need to reiterate it every now and then. As well as the fact that I deleted the first video where I ever spoke about it, but you know, I've said it multiple times since then, I think. Uh, but yeah, you know, I don't want this to be ruined for me or for you, because um, we've got, we've actually got an, a really good thing going here. And uh, as long as you guys are behind me, it can only really get better. And I know a lot of you are going to be like, well, we are behind you. It's only those few people who aren't quite, and I know that, and I I really appreciate that. And uh, I'm trying to show my appreciation a lot more nowadays. Um, but a lot of the time, it just doesn't quite hit me, and I'm sorry for that. Um, but, you know, I never want you guys to feel like I don't care that you're even here. Because reaching 5,000 
in just over a year is a really incredible achievement, and I often forget that. But yeah, I'm trying my best to remember that every day. You know, I love you all so much for all the support you've given me. So thank you for that. Thank you. Last quick announcement before I go, which may come as bad news to some. Mashed Bandicoot Part 2 may be slightly delayed. I know, I'm sorry. I was hoping to get it done by, like, I don't know, the, the 20th or something of February. But it might be put off until early March. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, I know I said February stupidly. Um, but, you know, other than what I was just talking about, you know, getting demotivated and needing to uh, take a break to work on other things, or just, you know, taking a break in general, because, uh, you know, this isn't my job. <laughs> I'm lucky that at the moment I've got tons and tons of spare time, and I'm making the most of it while it lasts. But, yeah, other than that, uh, my laptop is dying. And I don't mean the battery power, I mean the whole thing. Um, I can tell with everything it's been doing recently that it, it is trying to tell me it's near death and I need I need to get a new one. So, um, sometime soon I'm going to get a new laptop slash computer. I don't know which. A computer would probably last longer and, I don't know, it might be able to do more, it probably have more uh, processing power, but uh, there's not much room for a computer where I currently live. You know, actually, what do you guys think? Computer or laptop? I'll let you decide that in the comments. But yeah, hopefully I'll be getting that before this one dies. Everything's backed up, so don't worry about me losing what I've done so far. Everything's fully backed up, it's all fine. Um, but it will take me a while to get adjusted to a new one. And, you know, transfer all the data and stuff. Or data, however you'd like to say it. So, if not late February, then early March. Sorry again, <laughs> I've really got to get out of the habit of setting deadlines, because I can never meet them. I've met them, like, once in the entire... Like, I've set deadlines for almost every one of my videos. Um, I met the Mash Bandicoot one, and I met the Five Nights at Foster's one. Oh, Mash Bandicoot Part 1, at least. <laughs> but all the others I've missed. Um, the Five Nights at Foster's 2 collab will still be March 27th, though. That's a definite. And, yes, it is called... Um, Five Nights of Fosters 2, it's not 5,000 Nights of Fosters, that was a stupid joke based on the fact that we'd reached 5,000 subscribers, I'm, I'm sorry if that confused a lot of people. <laughs> um, and yeah, the the uh, deadline to get your entries done is March 18th, so you've still got plenty of time, well over a month. Um, so if you wanted to make an entry, you've still got loads of time, so, you know, go ahead. I've received some really great entries so far though, you know, I, I honestly wasn't expecting that many good ones. There are, you know, there are a couple that aren't that good, in my opinion. But, you know, the majority of them I was actually really, really impressed with. And, I, and that surprised me. So I'm really looking forward to putting that all together. So, um, to make it up to you guys for delaying part two, I will see you on the 14th for a special Mashed Bandicoot part two Valentine's Day preview. So hopefully that should make up for it. Anyway... Right now, there's something important I need to do. Don't worry about that. That'll make sense one day. <laughs> I promise. Thing off. So th something always goes wrong. Every time I try to do one of these, something goes wrong. Whether it be a cat. Actually, it's only ever been a cat other than this. I could tell you the story behind this if you want. Um, my sister had this book that was called something like, it was, I think it was called Wreck This Journal. And basically on every page, it had an instruction of what you were supposed to do with that page. Like stuff like, I don't know, soak this page in water or throw this page out the window. One of them said, sell this page. And so she sold it to me. And then I then changed the word page to bagel. I then glued it to a mouse mat and attached it to the wall. See how much effort I went to to make this look nice?